In today's video, we take a look at the F100 flashlight from Tactica, a clean, minimal and heavy duty flashlight with a number of different brightness options, a magnetic lanyard and a nice tactile experience. I'm Ed from Rush Faster and we do guides and walkthroughs bringing you better gear and better ways to carry. So if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, please consider subscribing and also hitting the bell. Let's dive in and check out the F100 flashlight from Tactica. Tactica is a company based in Melbourne, Australia that are well known for making multi-tools and they've won a number of awards from our friends over at Carryology, but now they've released their first flashlight, the F100 flashlight. Now, just to be upfront, there are many high performing, technical, feature rich and stronger flashlights and torches out there. This sort of flashlight isn't really meant to compete with the likes of those flashlights. This is a flashlight built for everyday use, built around a tactile experience and also designed with a clean and minimalist aesthetic that users should appreciate. So over the course of this video, we're gonna take a look at some of the features and technical aspects of the flashlight. And if you wanna check out more specs, click the link in the description below. Okay, so taking a look deeper, let's start off with some materials of the Tactica F100 flashlight. The exterior is a CNC machined aluminium and it also has a hard anodized finish on the outside. The paracord lanyard that comes with the flashlight is a quarter inch type 3 500 paracord. So it's a really heavy duty paracord, can take a lot of weight, really abrasion resistant. And the paracord catch there is made of the same composite material that Tactica uses in all the other multi-tools. A really lightweight, heavy duty composite material. And hopefully you can see embossed inside that composite lanyard adjuster is the Tactica logo. Very nice and subtle. And obviously on the flashlight, we have the Tactica text mark logo just there. In terms of the light itself, it is a Cree XPL2 V6 LED, and it will have an output of 3,200 milliamps per hour from an 18650 battery. Now the battery is easily removable and we'll show that later on in the video, but you can also charge the battery via a USB-C port. Now a few other quick specs about the flashlight. It has an IP68 waterproof rating, so that's about two meters. Its overall length is 145 millimeters, and without the battery, it weighs only 120 grams. It has an impact resistance from about one meter, and as mentioned, it is USB-C rechargeable. Another thing to mention about the flashlight is that it has variable brightness. So when you push on the tail cap switch just at the top here, you get the first mode, which is turbo. That's 1000 lumens, which runs for about 45 minutes. Next is high, which is 500 lumens, and that runs for four plus hours. Next is medium, and that's 250 lumens, and that's for six plus hours. And the last one is low, which is 50 lumens, and that runs for about 20 plus hours. Now, if you keep pressing on the tail cap switch, you'll keep rotating through those different variable brightnesses. So you can keep changing to whatever luminosity you require. And then when you wanna turn off the flashlight, you simply hold on for a few seconds and it turns off. Now, as mentioned, it comes with a magnetic lanyard, this paracord lanyard. You simply wrap it around the tail cap just at the bottom there, and then cinch it tight. And on the tail cap here, there is a little port for you to stick in that magnetic stud. This allows for a variety of different applications for the flashlight. You can simply hook it onto a backpack, or perhaps if you're camping, you could plug this into one of the tent poles and then cinch it up so you have a little bit of a lantern inside your tent. You can also loop this around on your shoulder straps of a backpack, or you could loop it around the belt loop of your pants so that you just have it nice and accessible around the waist. There are a number of different applications that you can have to use this magnetic lanyard. And when you don't want to use it, you can simply remove it, uncinch it, and then just use the flashlight on its own. A big focus of Tactica's design process is ergonomics, making the tool comfortable and a good experience to use. Much like the rest of their tools, they see tools as being an extension of the user, so they should be user-friendly and safe. And so with this in mind, Tactica has designed the flashlight with a strong focus on ergonomics. First of all, we have this nice smooth anodized finish, but we also have these little rivets here that just add a bit of that tactile feeling when engaging with the flashlight. And when you're activating the flashlight, when you're pressing on the tail cap here, we have this really nice force feedback spring-loaded pressure on that tail cap there, which gives it a nice solid tactile feeling and makes the flashlight overall really nice to interact with. And when you want to interact with the charging and the battery, you simply press slightly, 
turn the tail cap off and that releases the tail cap. Here we have our USB-C port for recharging the battery and we have an on and off switch which is what the tail cap interacts with. But when we twist off this end we get access to the battery here and inside hopefully you can see the cavity for that battery. Very clean, very simple design especially when you want to interact with the internals. And when you want to hook it back in place you simply line it up like so and you have it back to normal. Now the F100 flashlight comes with a few mounting options. This is one of them. This mount simply allows the flashlight to be attached on any metal surfaces magnetically. So in whatever situations you might be using the flashlight when you're tinkering with the car and putting this on the hood of the car to look inside the internals or when you're placing it on a workbench or in a workshop or if you want to simply just attach it onto a fridge for easy access using this little magnetic mount will make that really easy and useful. On top of this, Tactica has made a specific mounting scenario for bikes. So you can simply latch it on to this secondary attachment and then attach it to the handlebars of a bike so you can have easy visibility at night or in darker situations. And there are a number of little mounting accessories that allow for this bike mount to really secure onto any handlebar type. Now it needs to be said that Tactica relies heavily on customer feedback for the most and best ergonomic use cases and also for its applications. So further down the line, we might see other applications for mounting in specific scenarios that have been collected through the community and customer feedback. Well, everyone, there you have it, the Tactica F100 flashlight, a really heavy duty, well-designed flashlight that has a nice clean aesthetic for everyday use and is a nice alternative to your typical technical flashlight. If you're interested in getting one of these, there is a link in the description below as well as a QR code just on the screen for you to scan your phone camera. If you like this video, you found it helpful and you're thinking about getting one of these, please consider using those affiliate links as they really do help support the work of the channel at no extra cost to you. And if you'd like to support us further, you can hit the like button, hit the bell, let us know your thoughts about this flashlight in the comments below and let us know your thought about doing videos on this type of gear as well. We'd love to hear your thoughts on that. As always, subscribe to see more carry walkthroughs if you haven't already and also subscribe to our Rush Faster Carry Roundup newsletter as well. If you'd like to see more videos like this, there are links on the screen at the end of this video. But for now, this has been the Tactica F100 flashlight. Take care and we'll see you next time.